hanging out Hollywood Beach at the Broadwalk there. We can see that wind howling. When does it end, Angie? <laughs> Yeah, we have a couple of days to deal with it. Adam, you mentioned I'm here on Hollywood Beach, the broadwalk where folks are up and down running, biking, enjoying their morning, but having to deal with the breeze. Uh, you can tell my hair is blowing. It's not going to be a great hair day, and it's also causing problems here at the beach. Let's take a look at exactly what's going on. The sun is coming up. We're starting to get some of that first light. A gorgeous morning, but a windy morning causing issues out on those local waters. You can see those white caps at the water's edge with those waves elevated today. There is a high risk risk of rip currents that's going to stay with us through at least the next couple of days and a small craft advisory is going to be up as well through Sunday morning. Now, great conditions if uh, we're talking kite surfing, um, if we're talking flying kites, all good conditions for that, but so much for being in the water or on the water is going to be rough. Those wind gusts will stay elevated through Sunday. I've been uh, taking a look at my anemometer, seeing exactly where the average winds are. Uh, we're checking in about 20 miles per hour right now where I am, but you can see as we look towards gust, I've been recording them as high as 28 miles per hour. So over the next couple of days, especially into the afternoon hours, we will be close to 30 mile per hour gusts. So watch for that. Not great for playing beach volleyball, golfing, all those kind of things will be affected for outdoor activities through the weekend. Let's take a look at that seven day. Nice conditions because our rain chances are low, although this breeze will bring one or two showers on in for us. We've already been dealing with some of those for Broward County this morning, uh, but our temperatures are into the low 80s. And unfortunately, guys, our winds stay elevated. I can tell you 28 mile per hour gusts so far where I am. We'll give you another check here in just a bit. For now, let's get a check of those roads with Kristen. All right, thanks, Angie.